let us check out Tweet Hunter. What is really cool about Tweet Hunter, as you can see, there's a lot of different functionality here. My queue, my analytics. So I have been using Social Bee to share my blog posts to Twitter, but I use Tweet Hunter to create what I call authentically social content. They are not generating clicks, they are generating engagement. And what's really interesting is by using this tool, you're gonna to figure out really well what works in your market. Now, what I like to use here is Tweet Inspirations for you. Edit my personalized feed. So I am telling it, enter three to 10 keywords that will be used as search inspiration tweets. So marketing, digital marketing, social media marketing, influencer marketing, I think you get the picture. So based on that, the AI engine is gonna select tweets that are inspiring, that are both relevant, and also you can see here the performance that these tweets have had. So it's listing in almost like, um, you know, uh, Pinterest style, uh, all these cards that have actual tweets. These went out, you know, 2022, uh, December 14th, uh, April 23rd, 2021, actual tweets and actual performances. This one got 1000 likes and 33 retweets. Just by looking at these tweets, you get an idea of what works well on Twitter, right? And if, especially if you're not on Twitter a lot, uh, or you're not actively consuming it. Well, let's see here. Five side gigs, you can start with $0 an hour to study. Google's your friend. So what this does is I'm going to press this button. And what the button is going to do is going to recreate a tool, recreate this content. Five side gigs, you can start with $0 an hour of study, freelance and affiliate marketing, drop shipping, content marketing, digital product sales. Google's your friend. And it's basically going to redo it using AI. Um, so that it is not copying it, but it is an inspiration. I probably would not tweet like this, but for instance, you know, I would not recommend drop shipping, UGC uh, content creation instead of just content creation, digital marketing freelance work. So I would make slight adjustments, um, but what I'm using is, once again, it's like with phrase, with Google, we're standing on the shoulders of giants. We're looking at what does well and trying to align our content with that. I am using these as inspiration for me to create my own content using sort of a template that's already proven to be successful. And this has worked out really, really well for me. Um, in fact, if we go to my queue, so all I need to do here is add to queue and then it's in the queue. So if you go to my queue, you're gonna see content that has been, now I'm also adding my photo. This was inspired by what you see here in Tweet Hunter. You'll also notice I have an evergreen slot. So what the evergreen slot is, and man, there is a lot going on here. What the evergreen slot is, is I am saying, hey, when this reaches 10 likes, I want you to add it to the evergreen. So you can actually see the posts that have done really well on um, you know, the likes. Some of these have done better than others. Some have gotten 10, 15, 27. Um, but now every day it's going through and retweeting one of these as well. So even when I'm asleep, uh, even when I don't have new content to create, this is allowing me to do it. So this is a really fantastic tool. Once again, it is neilshafer.com slash tweet hunter, one of those ninja tools that I highly recommend.